Hello and welcome back to On The Workbench. Today we're taking a look at a pair of pliers from Nipex. If you've got a different preferred pronunciation, feel free to put it down in the comments below. What we're looking at today are a pair of German-made 1000 volt pliers, described as being flat-nosed and plastic. Kind of unique, kind of catchy, kind of weird. So let's take a look at this and see what we get in the package. What we've got here Looks like this, so we got our traditional VDE red and yellow colors. These are maybe not the smoothest opening pliers, but they certainly uh, work well. They're, the yellow color on here is a rubber over mold or a thermal plastic. And then we've got this red resin that is gonna be entirely non-conductive. You can see there's some slight serrations in the jaw. And when it's closed, there's a little bit of a round space and a uh, completely flat nose here, kind of like a pair of linesman pliers, if you will. The yellow spot here in the middle is not a button. These are not slip joint at all. And there's a nice uh, hand stop, if you will, at the top here to keep your hand from perhaps slipping forward and touching something that you really don't want to touch if you're working with live circuits. So why did I pick this up? Well, I thought these are the perfect pliers that if I need to replace a fuse in my automatic transfer switch, and since I can't make that box completely cold because uh, the legs coming in from the meter off the street, I would like to have a, something that makes me as completely safe as possible. And I think these just might be the ticket. If there's enough grip here, I can be able to grab those fuses. And the other reason for replacing those fuses is if I need to replace the battery in my generator, I need to actually pull the fuse from the charger uh, to be able to completely shut it down or other maintenance on it because there is a live uh, utility sense wire that comes over from the transfer switch to my generator. And if I'm going to work on the generator, I need to completely isolate those utility sense wires and cut the, the circuit from those by pulling the fuse. And so I think this is actually pretty neat. So I'm just going to show you that the not, they're non-conductive. All right, so now here I've got my multimeter set into continuity mode. I'll touch my leads together and the meter will beep. And so just for example, here is a regular traditional screwdriver. And if I just tap these leads on two points, we've got conductivity through the screwdriver. Now if I just start touching on different points on these pliers, There is absolutely nothing. These are non-conductive resin plastic to completely insulate yourself from the electric source that you are near. Just for comparison, here is a pair of 1,000 volt uh, VDE pliers from NWS. And even though these are rated for 1,000 volts, that protection is down here at the grip. But let's use this continuity meter and we will Yep, see right there? So even with other VDE pliers, you still may run the risk of shorting something out or touching something you didn't mean to touch with the metal end of the pliers, which is why Nipex also makes a pair of completely resin needle nose pliers to be able to mitigate that issue to avoid creating an accidental short circuit while also protecting yourself and other circuits nearby that may be live if you're working in a hot electrical environment. Obviously, you need to be safe working with electricity. And never work above your skill level. If you feel uncomfortable with the work that you are doing, consult a licensed electrician in your area. Always call and be aware of any other local codes that may preclude you from doing certain kinds of electrical work in your area. All right, so now I am in my generator's automatic transfer switch panel. I've got these Nipex non-conductive pliers. Go down here and we're gonna remove this fuse right here. That's for my battery charger. But I'm also gonna pull the other wires up here. This box is hot. And with these pliers here, I have a lot more confidence that I'm working safe and I'm not gonna accidentally touch something, create a short and create a bigger problem somewhere else in the circuit for me to deal with later. So that's your look at these Nipex non-conductive pliers. 
questions or comments, put it down below. Thanks for watching, and as always, have a great day. Bye.